Seed definitions. 1. A reproductive structure of plants. 2. Seed is a ripened ovule. 3. Any part of a plant planted in the soil for the further propagation of crop. 4. A seed is a miniature plant possessing all the characteristics of the type of cultivar to which it belongs. It is a terminal point in the life cycle of the mother plant as well as a starting point in the life cycle of the plant that follows it. Classes of seed or phases of seed production. 1. Prebasic or breeder seed. Seed or vegetative propagating material is produced under the direct responsibility of the breeder. 2. Basic or foundation seed. This seed is the progeny of the prebasic seed and is produced at the Seed Corporation government farms. 3. Certified or registered seed. It is the progeny of basic seed. The seed agencies produce the seed class with the registered growers. 4. Approved seed. It is the progeny of certified seed grown in a quarantined and isolated area. It is produced and distributed by various seed agencies. Properties of good quality seed. 1. The seed must be of an approved slash recommended variety. 2. It should suit the prevailing ecological condition of the area and the time of sowing. 3. It should be free from impurities such as foreign matter like stones, weed seeds, chaff, empty shells, etc. 4. It should be free from seed-borne diseases and insect pests. 5. It should be sound and of uniform size. 6. The varietal purity should be 100%. 7. Germination of the seed should be more than 90%. 8. Seed should be collected from healthy and fully matured crops. Advantages of using good quality seed. 1. High yield. 2. Higher returns from the produce. 3. Less quantity of seed is required for optimum plant population. 4. Less proneness to diseases. 5. Uniform crop maturity and hence lower pre- and post-harvest losses. 6. Low breakage, for example, rice. 7. Better cooking quality. 8. More price. Disadvantages of using poor quality seed. 1. Low yield. 2. Low returns from produce. 3. More quantity of seed needed for an optimum plant stand. 4. High attack of diseases to the crop. 5. Non-uniform maturity of the crop and hence, greater pre- and post-harvest losses. 6. Non-uniform drying of the produce. 7. More breakage. 8. Poor cooking quality. 9. Low price. Cause of deterioration of seed. 1. Mechanical mixtures. It may often occur at the time of sowing if more than one variety is sown with the same seed drill. Two varieties growing alongside each other in the field are often mixed somewhat during harvesting and threshing operations. Usually, the seed produce of all the varieties is kept on the same threshing floor, resulting in many varietal mixtures. Combining or threshing equipment is often contaminated with seeds of other varieties. Further, the gunny bags, seed bins, etc., are often contaminated with seeds of other varieties. 2. Attack of diseases. New crop varieties often become susceptible to new races of diseases which are out of seed programs. Similarly, in species that are vegetatively propagated, for example, sugarcane, there may be an accumulation of viral, fungal, and bacterial diseases within some of the seed stock of variety. These are transmitted through the sets from one year to the next and spread the disease. 3. Adulteration. Mixing of poor quality seed with good quality seed or mixing of seed of different varieties by some dealers of seed corporation and other seed merchants. 4. Storage conditions. The viability of the seed rapidly decreases when the storage conditions are not ideal. The rate of deterioration of the seed increases as the seed moisture content increases beyond 8 to 12 percent due to mold growth on and in the seed and higher respiration losses. Very low moisture contents, below 4%, may damage seeds due to extreme desiccation.
storage fungi and bacteria are active above 75 and 90 percent relative humidity, respectively. At high temperatures, respiration losses are also high. Dry, cool conditions are best for seed storage.